What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. This video I want to show you what is the integral of sine x over 1 minus sine x. So what I need to do, I have sine x over 1 minus sine x. I just need to multiply the numerator and denominator by the conjugate of the denominator. So here in the denominator I have 1 minus sine x. It means that I multiply it by 1 plus sine x and 1 plus sine x. The reason I multiply it by the same thing for the numerator and denominator is that any expression divided by itself is 1 and when we multiply the denominator by this expression for example we need to do the same thing with the numerator because we don't want to change the ratio. Then you multiply it, it's going to be sine x times 1 plus sine x and here, 1 minus sine times 1 plus sine is going to be the difference of squares, which is going to be 1 minus sine squared x dx. Then when you distribute it, it's going to be sine x plus sine squared x divided by 1 minus sine squared x dx. Then instead of sine squared x, I can write 1 minus cosine squared x. divided by 1 minus cos sine squared is going to be cosine squared x. Then here I separate all of them. It's going to be sine x over cosine squared x plus 1 over cosine squared x minus cosine squared x divided by cosine squared x dx dx dx. Now if I consider u as cosine x, du will be negative sine x dx or sine x dx will be negative du. So I'm going to have negative du over u squared. And here we have 1 over cosine squared dx. The derivative of this part, I'm going to find out later on. And here we have cosine squared divided by cosine squared, which is going to be 1 dx. So now we have negative du over u squared, which will be just 1 over u, we had it before, or you can say u to the power of negative 2 plus 1 divided by negative 2 plus 1, and the negative over there, negative and negative cancel out, is going to be u to the power of negative 1, which is 1 over u, plus the integral of 1 over cosine squared x dx, we had it before, is going to be tan x, and the integral of 1 dx is going to be just x. So the plus a constant number. So u is cosine x, so it's going to be 1 over cosine x plus 1 over tan x, actually just tan x minus x plus a constant number. So that's going to be the final answer to this question. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Thank you for watching and have a great day.